hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you continue to have a wonderful day. And thanks for stopping by. Bye. <laughs> thanks for stopping by Dancing Critter Acres. I'm Dean. If you're new to this channel, do me a favor. Watch some of my other videos. Check out the content. See if you like what you see. Or if it's content that you like. If you do, do me another favor. Go ahead and tap that subscribe button. Ring the notification bell. Give me a thumbs up on the videos that you like. Leave comments. I do respond to my comments. Might take me a little bit, but I do respond to them. To my current subscribers, you guys, I greatly appreciate you. Each and every one. Many thanks for sticking with me through all my little adventures on uh, uh, Homestead and that. And uh, wandering through the woods with me on snowshoes. Uh, this is totally and completely out of the norm for me. I'm trying something new. Uh, kind of got the idea from another YouTuber called Rocking Sea Homestead. Lance and Marcy are some really good folks. They live down, I think it's around Tulsa, Oklahoma. I could be wrong, but uh, check out their channel. They do some, they've got Nigerian dwarfs, they've got chickens, they do gardenings. They had a phenomenal garden this year uh, with raised beds. Anyhow, in this video, I'm going to do bacon wrapped spatch quail in the oven with a homemade version of a dirty bird rub on it. And I've got carrots, uh, potatoes, celery. I forgot to slice up an onion. Uh, but uh, we'll, I'll be right back. Okay guys, sorry about that. <laughs> I had to slice up a small onion real quick. Bacon wrapped dirty bird, uh, splat, spatched. Dirty bird quail meal. Out here. All right. There's carrots, celery, potatoes. Now, I just, I sliced, I don't know how well you can see. Uh, about three eighths of an inch, and I split them right down the middle. And this just, you know, break them up, sprinkle them in. I don't, I, I really don't know how this will turn out. I've, I've never made anything like this, so my family is going to be guinea pigs along with me. But the quail, they came from the quail that I raised on the property. Some of the birds that I've culled out, too many roosters at one time. Uh, getting to that point again, I've got some older birds that I want to call out. Uh, they're not producing eggs. So, they'll go to freezer camp. Okay, you can see the onions in there now. Now, spatched quail, or the spatched bird, you cut the backbone out, okay? And quail's a little bird, but cut the backbone out, and then you cut through the breast, the wishbone area here, and then you're getting them to flatten out. I'm going to throw them in a bowl, and I'm going to sprinkle my dirty bird rub.
All right, guys. I've got the oven preheated to 375. Here's how they look. Wrapped in bacon. Butter on them. Veggies. Took a little bit of the rub. Throw it on them. I'm going to bake them for 20 to 30 minutes until they're done. Hopefully the veggies, because don't know about the carrots because they're baby carrots. Uh, if they'll be done, might have to pull the birds off and bake the veggies a little longer. So when that is done, I'll bring you guys back and show you what it looks like. All right, guys. They smell great. Uh, I'll bring you over to show you. They, they really smell good. I mean, I, I truly can't wait to the day the, the, with uh, Smell-O-Vision on YouTube uh, because of all the different people that do cooking on their show, on their homestead channels and that. And, the, I mean, if this is what Lance's and Marcy from Rocking Seas Homestead spatted chicken, spatched chicken, smelt like, my gosh it's it's just phenomenal i'm gonna grab a fork and check the veggies out real quick got me a carrot here two thumbs up on that Potato. Mmm. That rub's got a good flavor to it. Piece of celery. I love cooked celery. Guys, that's... That's good. That's good. Let's get one of these quail. Quail thigh and drumstick. Oh, guys. This is good. This is good. Mm. Dang. <laughs> Guys, that is finger looking good. As always, guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you continue to have a wonderful day. Thanks for stopping by Dancing Critter Acres. You guys take care of yourselves. Best wishes to each and every one of you. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. This is Dean signing off. Bye, everybody.